Uh, this course was perfect for me because it covered shooting, but it also covered editing. Uh, David was a, is a world class uh, VJ, and you know the stuff he taught us you was so valuable to learn. Uh, and he gave lots of you know lots of little tips here and there that really uh, are so important that I'll take on. Can you give us um, probably definitely tagging. That's something that I don't normally do a lot or at all. That was a whole new thing. And then the Gonzo journalism, the dirty journal, the dirty video shooting, uh, was all new to me. Uh, by trade, I'm a, I'm a TV uh, video journalist, photographer, photojournalist, whatever you want to say. Uh, well, uh, I have to say I rock now as a video. <laughs> Honest to God, I came here not feeling not feeling I needed to so much because I've made a lot of videos, but they're all they're all pretty simple. The, what I learned here was an enor how, just an, how, how enormously complex you can weave all these different visual images and audio and even music into this much richer storytelling medium than I've been doing, which is like people in the conga line, you know, it's just, it's been really instructive. I'm excited about being able to add this sort of bullet in my belt now, you know. Um, I like the tagging, uh, learning a little bit more. I mean, it's something I've been doing for years, but nothing real, um, you know, as a technique necessarily. Um, it, it was something that I probably just have been doing sort of not quite right. Yeah, tagging is where you kind of just follow the motion. You look for a subject and then you look for the verb associated in that shot. So like your face to your hands. One thing David did that was really beneficial was he deconstructed a lot of videos. He would talk about something and then he would give examples of, oh, oh like in the TV show 24 or in the TV show uh, or, or in this movie, they do this. And he was really able to uh, give good examples like that to make it so you'd understand. And then he also show lots of examples. He would say, oh, this is like how they do it in this TV show. And then he would show us a clip from that TV show. And uh, now when I watch TV, I'm going to be deconstructing stuff a lot more.